Hello everybody, Fix it here. Welcome back to Observer. We're making our way towards the tattoo shop, and uh, we still need to figure out a way how to get into the basement. The tattoo shop first. Oh. Thought I heard footsteps. It's just birds. I'm getting frames dropping all over the place too. All right. In sickness and in health. Well, okay then. Let's check over here for some stuff first. And there's stuff on the floor. Unregistered pre-war components detected. Too funny. Cassandra, personal computer? Uh, basic audio recording device. Six five six two one zero. Oh. We have a third victim. Time of death about an hour ago. Starting forensic analysis. Let's do this one first. No match found. Abnormal genetic structure detected. There's a bad guy on the lease. The victim's blood is mixed with ink. Elevated hormone levels. Oh, fuck. Don't tell me. Um, I'm not sure what he's implying. Her blood has ink in it. Okay, um. Oh, shit, man, there's stuff everywhere. Wireless pedal. It's the tattoo, unregistered pre-war. The killer used the tattoo machine as a murder weapon. Got it. Power adapter. Probably for the tattoo gun. Hollow injector. Hollow injector. Now, what would that do? Is that it? I hear whispers. You hear those? Oh, I thought that was a door. It is a door, right? Okay. Um. Oh shit. You were not made to live like brutes, but to pursue virtue and knowledge. We are all as humans prone to justify our behavior. Do not admit our wrongdoings and insist that we are in the right. I'm sure the simpletons investigating my so-called crime thought themselves justified. They could not fathom that progress demands Sacrifice. I'm guessing I can play this one too then. Midway upon the journey of our life, I found myself within a forest dark, for the straightforward pathway had been lost. It is the seventh day of my forcefully imposed penance, and I can already attest without any doubt that this place is in fact hell. These people are dead. Dead to the world. Their bodies still shuffle around their tiny apartments, but their minds are long gone. Lovely. Um, what does this say? 
door to the tattoo parlor has been smashed. There's a faint smell of blood. That's not gone, so it feels like I haven't... I haven't... Oh! Like, where is that music coming from? I don't see any speakers. Am I blind? I have no idea. Obviously, there is something in here still that... Oh! What is that? What is this? What do I do with this thing? Wait a minute. What am I doing here? There's gotta be a reason for this, right? What's the point of... Hello? code is. Um. Hold on. Is there more stuff that I just didn't see? Oh, there is. And obviously I want to have to go into her mind, right? We got right? a match. So you called the dead man in Adam's apartment. Okay. Um. I guess we're going to hop right in, right? Like this, this right now, I'm getting 40 frames. Jesus. The neural implants untouched. All right, I'm guessing we're gonna lose use the code or find out the code to use on the chair while we're in her brain. Let's do it. Warning: Attempting a necroneural connection is in direct violation of the Postmortem Observation Act of 2061. Let's not do it. Authorization denied. Emergency override. Open maintenance panel. Okay. This better be worth it. I have a feeling this one's going to be jacked up. Three three five one junior programmer loading. Loaded. Welcome, Miss Novak. You are a valuable asset to our company. Your hard work and loyalty are always appreciated. Please relax and answer as truth truthfully as you can. Do you want your homeland to thrive? Um. Okay! Sorry! Do you want to make the world a better place? Do you want to live without fear? Oh, look at that. It won't let me do it. Do you want to establish a productive relationship with Chiron? Will you cooperate? Press O. Will you comply? Will you conform? I'm pressing other keys. Alright, it wants E. I'm conforming just by doing this. The Republic is your mother. Chiron is your father. A mother's love is unconditional. A father's pride demands sacrifice. Are you willing to sacrifice for their greater good? Work, productivity, happiness, 
You will be happy. You will be productive. You will work towards the greater good. Will you obey? There's that word, obey. So, I feel like there is some They Live um, inspiration here. I don't know if you guys have seen that movie. It was like 87, 88, something like that. And it stars, um, uh, what's his name? Is it Keith David, is it? Or David Keith? Oh my god, I don't remember which one it is. Keith David, whatever. And um, Rowdy Roddy Piper, the old 80s wrestler. And they live in a, in a society, and, 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 and Roddy has these sunglasses where he wears them, he can see the truth, in a way. And the truth is, is that there are aliens there, they are impersonating people, and they, um, he can see like the truth behind signs, like advertisements and stuff like that. So instead of saying something like, um, you know, a, a billboard that says like Game of Thrones on Sunday, it'll say obey, or it'll say um, other things like that um, conform. Um, I feel like this game has some obvious inspiration there. But when you when you look at the aliens, you, they had like the skeletal face, kind of like what we saw earlier when I mentioned it. Um, loading. Finalizing subject assessment. Checking answers. Analyzing behavioral patterns. Evaluating life choices. Warning. Subject spouse. Criminal record. Checking. No liability regarding current appointment. Point deduction minor. Warning ignored. Calculating score. Are we in this because it's she's like old school? What the frick, man? This is trippy as balls. Well, there's a red light over there. And a chair that's floating. I'm guessing we're going that way then. Sorry for the darkness. They done blew up that chair. Alright, we're in some kind of... company. So what is this showing me that that we're all mindless zombies? Okay. Brogies. This fucking slop again. It's called soup. Now dig in. It's not getting any better. Come here. Fuck, are you? There is a, a mechanical snack going through here. Was that him? I think that was him, guys. Oh! Pardon me. What the shit is that? Yeah, this is this is glitchy as hell. Nope, I don't go that way. I don't go that way, okay. Well, which way do I go? Am I missing something? Do I go to this? I do, apparently. Why'd you guys stop? Oh, that is so weird! They only move when I move. This game is trippy as hell, man. This 
would be so amazing in VR, I'm telling you. This is the first time a game ever made me want to... Wait, what do I do now? I'm stuck. Can't go this way. I don't know what I do. Did that thing move? Oh my god. I feel like I'm going in circles now. Oh Jesus Christ. Well, I didn't see that. What the shit is that? I don't I don't like that noise like at all. What was that? for no reason whatsoever. <laughs> Alright. What is that, a crab? Okay. This game is trippy as fuck, man. Trippy as fuck. What the hell's going on outside now? Patient cart ready to print. Automatic printing set to 3.20 a.m.? One fifty one. What was it? I don't remember. Was it three twenty? Okay. First on the scene, no suit, no chance. Is that telling me a story? I just got an achievement for Outbreak, so he was the first on the scene to the Outbreak, I am assuming. Interesting. Um. Let's just pretend I didn't see that. Oh boy. Get ready. God, that looks so trippy. And laggy. Amir, do you remember the night we met? I'm guessing this is the night they met. Hey, baby, I'm home. The shit. 
Oh, that's lovely. Christ. That sounds awful. What is it? Oh my god. How do you even know how to talk through something like this? How to do commentary through gameplay like this? Because this is just trippy as hell. Oh, he's a wow. Oh shit. Amir, is that you? Your decision. Amir, is that you? I did not open that. It is so wavy. Oh my god, hope you guys aren't getting sick. Oh, there we go. I'm home. I'm home. I can't do this anymore. I just can't. Oh my god. Gabinet? Lakarski? Here is your number. Thank you. 896. I wonder if that is the code to get into the, the chair? Or at least part of the code? Wait your turn. Sorry. The end. Imagine the amount of work that they had to put in to make these these sequences, these observer sequences, because they're so highly detailed and they're so long and they're so trippy. Imagine the amount of work that they had to put into this. It's amazing. Oh my god, there's like an actual person? Is is mom gonna be all right? Probably not. She's sick. Adam. Let's have a little faith. It's just hard to say. So Adam, is that my son? Oh, oh. Did I have a son? Am I learning? Am I learning history? Do we have some character development here? I'm not sure about this. Not sure. <sighs> Didn't you hear? This, this is great news. Let's take some more time to think about it. What is there to think about? You should be happy. Who says I'm not happy? So, I'm confused now. Because I have my voice, right? I have Daniel's voice, but I'm inside of... Oh, uh, what the hell is her name? Nowak? I don't remember her name. So what's going on? I don't see your chance. I want nothing to do with that. Nothing.
Oh boy. I mean that... I love the detail in this game, the detail of the environments. Creepy as hell. Yeah, I know you. Pardon me. All right, you can get up now. Just take it easy. It is it is it done? Right, Congratulations. So you are now the proud owner of a CT72 internal data storage. I've given you an accelerant to make the tissue heal faster. Just keep that dressing on for the next couple of days. You uh you sure they won't find it? It's got a built-in scrambler and a shielded frame. No external scanning equipment can penetrate it. It's ghostware. Undetectable. Unless you know exactly where to look. Okay. So this is... I'm assuming that was Miss Nowak. And we're gonna find this data drive with, with memories on it or something, I suppose? Hello, floating bucket. Are you looking for a walrus? Who is this? The hell did you do to yourself? And her... And that's... Is that... Um... Don't even start. I did what I had to. It's about time someone around here showed some initiative. What's that supposed to mean? Oh, you don't know. So she got into a fight with Amir over augmentations. Where am I supposed to go? Do I not go over this way? Nope. So we're upside down. Or the world is upside down, one of the two. No, please, tell me. Tell me again how useless I am. How I can't keep a job because no one will hire a fucking junkie ex-con. The shit was that? Do you even know what you're getting into? Hey, this looks a little cleaner. It's not like I have a choice. We need the money, Amir. Whatever it takes. Huh. How does having an internal hard drive... Whatever it takes. Mark my words. <laughs> that shit is gonna be the death of us. <laughs> Okay, I don't have any choice but to download. I can't do anything else. Oh, I know what's going on. Oh boy. So she is, this is perhaps her place of em employment, right? I'm guessing. Um, or she, or she got a job at a company where she was stealing data. That's why she needed the ha internal hard drive. She's downloading this project, this confidential project, to her hard drive, and then of course selling it to someone else, a competitor, whatever, right? So that's that's what she's doing. At least that's what it looks like it's, she's doing to me. I still look like an observer. this I just I don't know I just think they did a fantastic job on the visuals of this game that that looks unpleasant is 
gonna chase me? I thought he was gonna chase me. And what is what is he supposed to be exactly? Is he supposed to be like a doesn't run very quickly. Oh, run, girl, run. Christ on a cross. Oh, my God. Where am I going? This episode is so goddamn long. Man, when I get a VR headset, this is going to be the first game I play. Absolutely. This is awesome. I bet people would get so sick in this game in VR, though. I don't know if I would. I've never, I've never used VR. Um, although I do not, I do not get sick in regular games. Like a lot of people, if they get the wrong field of view, or if there's too much motion, some people, a lot of people, get sick. I've never really had that problem. I've never got ill during a game before. So is this big dude, is he like the IT department? Why is that one lit up again? Does that mean this one back here? Because I was looking, I, apparently I was looking at the back of the computer, not the front. Oh, he's over there now. You see, I was looking at that side. This is the side I want. What is that? Do I even want to go there? Wow! Seriously, can you just imagine that in VR? Holy cow. That looks terrifying. I'm waiting for someone's shadow to appear there. Oh, secrets! Wait, was that door locked then? Hold on. Okay, yeah. I had to go here anyway. You're the wrong kind of snack for that drain there, Chief. Where am I going? I clicked on it, so I, I feel like I changed what was going on there, but I don't know. was that? I just don't know what to say. 
say, man? Oh my god! Is that a heart? Oh my god! Holy shit! I don't want to go near there. Excuse me, I would like to walk by. Oh my god, I gotta I have to walk up to it, don't I? Oh my god, it, it smacked me! It keeps smacking me, what do I do? Oh! There was something on the ground, I clicked on it! Why is there a baby crying? Was the girl pregnant? I don't know what's going on. What the f is this shit? is going on here? <laughs> what? Don't look at me, TV. Oh my god. I can't see a freaking thing. Do I have to unplug it now? What the shit? What is that? What is that? Oh my god, this is terrifying! says don't leave me <laughs> it gets too dark in some places and I've got the gamma cranked on this guys I'm sorry if you can't see anything but I think you can get the gist of it What do I got to do here? How do I get through that? No, no, no. What are you doing? What did it do? Um, is it glitching out? Uh-oh. Oh, it's over here now. Okay, I'm going this way. Screw that. going on it won't let me the things all over the screen oh my god
It's glitched out, I think intentionally. I'm doing something wrong. No, I don't I don't want anything to do with that. I think I I think I may have screwed up. I think this needs to be plugged in. Here. And then you come back over here. Aha! What? <laughs> Assholes. This is so trippy, man. This is this is quite a unique experience. The door is well, let's close now. So it's like the light from the TV lets me see through the corruption. Damn it, where do I go for that? I probably don't need that anymore, do I? Uh oh, it's dead! Okay. What do I do? Hopefully I can unplug the door over here, right? Ooh, downloading again. So we're, we're, we're basically going through her, her memories. It's all corrupted and whatnot, and we're re-downloading whatever it is she downloaded. Right, settle down, kid. Fantastic. Oh boy. Wait a minute, is this this is the this is the beginning apartment, guys? There. Looks like we got all of it. So what is all of this stuff exactly? It's probably best if you don't know. Exactly. It's not anything nasty, is it? Like a virus or some top secret weapon type shit? <laughs> no. Nothing like that. What then? I mean what could possibly be worth the risk? The phage. The future. I thought I was going to say the phage. What the F? What the F is this game? Is it is it training me? Is it showing me if I stop moving, it won't attack me? I guess I don't know. Back to normal. He said it's undetectable. Look at look at the the corn. It's cables. That's fantastic. I love the detail. open area oh boy oh shit he 
see nothing. You see absolutely nothing. Ooh, it worked. That'd be a great screenshot. There we go. Downloading more Everyone's than one on thing. You. you don't get it. Every time I go in there, it's like they're all watching. Yesterday, this executive creep gave me this look like I, I could just tell he knew. If they knew, we'd all be dead by now. Maybe they're just messing with our heads. And what purpose would that serve? I don't know. To get their fucking sadistic load off. That's not how they operate. Trust me. I was with the corporation long enough. Okay. So she was downloading many things. And we're, we're basically experiencing her stress of, of having to do so. And her memories. My god, this is... Trippy. this game what the fuck what oh boy oh pretend we didn't see that what is on the streets it didn't have to be this way There you go. So what is So what is this creature that is haunting us? Is that the fade? No synchronization. Administer
Wow, that is just one crazy experience. My god. Yes. Synchrony yes. injected. Strain level decreased. Oh my god. 3615, was it? Let's give it a shot. It sure was, Chief. So what does that do for me? It does that. Okay. Oh, that's Rutger Howard. It actually has his name. First name, uh, first name Rutger, last name Howard. Augmentation Dependency Therapist. Ready for disposal. Date of birth, 1992. Died at 48. Do All right, so we got the the basement. Can I not get back there? I guess. Is there a way to crouch? No. All right. Well, I'm I'm gonna call that an episode. I that was a long recording session. So what I'll probably do is, and you'll know this by now, is I'm gonna break it up because I can't put a, uh, an hour ten minute long episode out there. Okay. Wow, that was amazing. Um, it's getting exciting. We'll see you guys next time. Bye bye.